at the University of Nairobi, we have different faculties, departments, and courses. And it is a place where you get to actualize your dreams. So today, we'll have a glimpse of the day in the life of a journalism student. And today we have our guest who's going to introduce herself and she's going to tell us how her typical day as a student journalist looks like. Hi, my name is Marilyn Tenui. I'm a student journalist here at the University of Nairobi taking a course in Journalism and Media Studies 4.1. Now, a typical day for me looks like this. I get here at around 9 a.m. and head over to the UNC studio where we have both uh, UNC Radio and UNC TV. So on a typical day, I head over there. Uh, we create news stories, we source them from within campus and also without, package them into um, news stories and also present them uh, at 1 p.m. for the bulletin. Um, on special occasions, we have uh, major productions like the UN graduation, the 70th, and uh, that, that was one of my biggest productions, actually. I got to report on uh, and ad-lib on the graduation. Uh, it was the first time, and I, I really enjoyed the experience. And that marks the end of the 70th edition of the University of Nairobi graduation 2023. Now with over 9,000 graduates graduating this year, the University of Nairobi has proven once again to be a world-class university committed to scholarly excellence. Reporting for UNC TV, Marion Tenui. So this is our recording booth where we do uh, recordings for any kind of production, be it news features, documentaries, radio dramas, news, you name it. Now, moving on to other news, Attorney General Justin Muturi has endorsed the Affordable Housing Bill, saying it addresses issues raised by the court. Appearing before the National Assembly Housing and Urban Planning Committee, Muturi, however, advised the National Assembly to ensure the bill is forwarded to Senate as it continues to... Life at the University of Nairobi can be both challenging and fun. And today, we have witnessed the day in the life of a student journalist. Until next time, I have been your host, Anthony Muga. Thank you.